Hi there. Uh, I'm going to walk you through a little bit more about conventional shavers using with our Vita Classic elements. So uh, a lot of people in the hotels and conventional centers, they already have made purchases on uh, traditional uh, shavers, just similar to this one. So this is, uh, uh, we got it from our, a regular supplier. So this is not something that we sell, but I just want to show you how we can implement the elements into the traditional shavers. So over here, if you lift off the uh, foot pan, you see that there's like a, a well that where you can pour the water in. So instead of you pour the water, you can actually consider putting two of the cold cell here and apply the foot pan to it. Or you can actually put the hot cell in there, turn it on, put it underneath, right? So that's one way to do it. But for some of the shavers, you have to understand because there are so many different manufacturers that manufacture shavers. So the depth of the water, it's, it varies. Some will have a deeper well, some will have a shallower well. So if you have a, for something like a shaver like this one, you might not be able to use the hot cell because if you put the two hot cell, if you put the foot pan in here, it sticks out, right? So you cannot really close it. So this shaver, this type of shavers, cannot use the hot cell or the cold cell. So the only way for cordless heating for this this particular shaver, we have to use the heat blaster, right? So you can put two of the heat blaster here, or maybe you use one, or open the pack, pour the water, activate the steam, and then you can close it like this, right? So. Voila, okay, so for some of the shavers that have deeper well, deeper water well, we have this performance mat. You can put it underneath it, and then you can put the hot cell. Please make sure the surface of the glass must contact the bottom of the pan directly because if there's no direct uh, contact to the foot pan, the heating performance will not be as good as uh, you want it to be, all right? So remember, always use the performance mat to raise up the hot cell, uh, give it a nice contact to the foot pan bottom, okay? That's it.